Yo, once again, it's on. Back at you one more again. Real Ken's TV in the house like kitchen sinks. Hopefully you like the video. Feel free to share. Definitely comment. Uh, subscribe to the Chiz handle. So anytime I bring you this, this heat and this action, guess what? You're amongst the first to receive. And with no further ado, let's get into this evening's video, if you will. Listen, this is going to be a very short video. Um, I want to address all my Dallas Cowboy uh, hater nations. Listen, we lost. You know what I mean? No excuses. Arizona came and, and they conquered. They kicked our butts, man. You know, I think that Dallas, it's a good loss for them. You know, I think they were starting to feel themselves a little bit too much. They got cocky. It's the NFL, man. It's 32 teams, man. Everybody's pros. Everybody's coming in trying to take your head off. They don't care anything about America's team. They came in, executed a great uh, game plan, and uh, congrats, you know, to Arizona, man. They they just outplayed Dallas, man. That's just what it is. You know, I'm still at work. I've been at work all day, um, but you know I got that NFL network. So, you know, I'm working, and I'm checking the game out on my tablet and listening to the other game on the radio, and I'm playing fantasy football. But I will say I'm in three fantasy football leagues, and I went 3-0 and today. So, you know, that, that was a bright spot. But my Cowboys losing, it's not a good day when the Cowboys lose. So you all know that I, I really love you. <laughs> you know what I mean? I really must love you all to, to make a video um, when the Cowboys lose. Man. Now, I've been a Dallas Cowboy fan all my life. There's been no other NFL team. I love the NFL. I love, I absolutely love the NFL. I love sports, you know. I like college football. Um, college basketball is cool. I like the NBA, but I'm just a, I'm a sports guy, you know. And you know, we we need to take Dallas needs to take something from this, learn something from it, you know. Hit chalk. That's what you you know. You hit the film, you know. To hit hit the film room. Uh, understand where you all went wrong. Understand you know certain things um, so that next week. Hopefully the same thing doesn't happen because people's talking about undefeated and I mean it's only been two weeks. Play 17 games at this point. It's been two weeks, so you can't speak about going undefeated. Everybody's hungry. Everybody's coming to to take your head off. Pause. You know what I mean? So you can't just you know think that every week. Oh, we the Cowboys. We gonna man. We got our butts kicked. Dallas got their butts kicked today. Like I said, no hate. Congratulations to. Uh, to Arizona, you know, they, they definitely did their thing. I see the comments. Dallas sucks, and, and I understand. America's team, baby, I mean, that's just what it is, man. When you're America's team, see, America's team is it's kind of, I, I, I uh, uh, relate that to Jay Williams. <laughs> you know, I'm always throw Jay Williams in the mix. I relate uh, the Cowboys to Jay Williams. When you win it, everybody hates you. You know what I mean? Everybody loves to hate you when you win it. And as soon as you have a mishap, you slip up a little bit, guess what? I told you. I told you so. So, you know, I just thought I'd jump on there and have a little fun with you all. I'm still at work. As I mentioned, I've been at work all day long. The one bright spot of the day is that my fantasy squads went 3-0. and And we don't do free fantasy uh, football leagues. You know, I'm in three uh, high-stakes fantasy football league so you know we we we, we proud i'm three and oh in one league no actually i'm three and oh in two leagues and then the other league i'm two and one so you know i take this football thing very very serious same way i take you all very very serious you know what i mean i see all your comments i read all your comments it gets a little you know overwhelming at times because i can't respond to every single comment as i've previously mentioned so if I don't, don't get offended. Don't feel like, oh, well, you know, he can't. I mean, I just, you know, it's so difficult. So just imagine someone that has way like thousands and thousands of, uh, um, you know, followers, uh, subscribers, whatever you want to, whatever you want to refer to it as. There's no way that you can respond to 1,500 comments. Not that I got 1,500 comments, but I'm just, I'm just simply saying. But best believe. All of you all are appreciated. Um, again, I read every last comment, even the haters. I read the haters' comments. I, I see you hating. You know what I'm saying? With your high beams on, I see you hating. 
but um you know it's just part of life i don't take anything personal um it's just all in fun you know i don't make any money off of doing youtube people people have made statements to me um uh, it must be nice to just you know talk about uh jay williams and and, and make money and i don't make any money off of youtube not at this point and if I never make a dime off of YouTube, that's fine with me. I do this because I like to do it. You know, it's cool. It's cool. It's, it's, it's a way for me to get on here and, you know, just sometimes it's like my therapy. You know, I'm able to get online and, and talk about some things and, you know, just get some things off my chest. You know, pause, double pause. You know, so it's not about making money. I'm going to keep it real with you. The likelihood of me making money on here is very, very likely. Like, really, really soon. Really soon. But that was never my purpose for jumping on YouTube. You know? I didn't really know too much about the monetization. I knew about it, but I didn't really know a whole lot about it. You know? And now I find myself... I find myself, like, engaging, you know, in the audience. I find myself, you know missing you all just as well so you know it's cool you feel me it's cool but um i'm gonna get on back to work i just wanted to uh take accountability you know because i jumped on here earlier go cowboys and you know i didn't really talk a lot of trash but you know i was just excited um i get very excited on football sunday man you know football Sunday, then you got Monday night football, then you got Thursday night football, so those are the nights that, or the days that, I try to be in the same mood every single day, but those are the days that I'm just really, really pumped, I'm ecstatic, I'm, I'm, you know, but every day I'm happy, because I'm out of prison, man, been out of prison for years, but every day that I'm out, outside of them gates, I'm happy, man, you know what I mean, but, um, I'm still ride or die Dallas Cowboys, you know, just had a bad day today, hey, that's cool, I'm not even going to say we had a bad day. We just got our butts kicked. We, we, Dallas, I say we, but, you know, Dallas Cowboys, I say we because, you know, it's Cowboy Nation. We got our butts kicked. No excuses. None. We lost. The refs didn't cheat. Dak wasn't hurt. We didn't have no uh, injuries, any fluke play. We got our butts kicked, and I can accept that. You know, we're going to learn from this victory, as I stated a couple minutes ago. And just move on to the next week. Man, Real Kings TV. Hopefully you uh, like the video. You know, you don't rub it in, you know. Don't rub it in too bad, you know. Pause once again. You know, um, feel free to comment. I'm sure you will. Share. I don't know if I want you all to share this video. Because Dallas lost, so I don't, I don't know. Maybe we'll hold back on the shares. You feel me? We'll, we'll hold back on the shares because Dallas lost. We'll hold the shares off for when Dallas wins. Um, subscribe to the Chizano. So anytime I bring you this, this action, this heat, guess what? You're amongst the first to receive it. Now, let me get back to work. You feel me? Dallas for life. Real Kings TV. Hey, free Jay Williams, man. Till the next time.